Hey everybody, super excited to introduce you to the newest member of my family, the Family Cargo Bike. These bikes are actually really popular over in Europe, but here in America, not so popular. In fact, there's only a couple of companies even making these bikes. And so I did a lot of research trying to figure out what the best decision was and ultimately went with a company called Furla Bikes. They're out of California and I'm super happy with my choice. We originally went with the family cargo bike because we wanted to decrease our dependency on cars and not worry about check engine lights or oil changes or car insurance. And now this bike has transformed our way of life. I take this bike everywhere with my kids. We go to the doctor's office, the grocery store, to the park, church, restaurant pickup. We take it everywhere. It truly has become our second mode of transportation. I love it. My kids love it. I'm super happy I went with Fur the Bikes. They have been awesome to work with. Uh, customer service, the design, the build, the specs, everything about it has been top notch and we are so happy with them. When buying your Fur the Bike, you're going to have the option to add on a few different accessories. We ended up buying most of them, so I'm going to give you a quick rundown as to which ones we bought and why we did it. First off, seat cushions. Kind of a no-brainer. Your kids will be happy with you, otherwise their bums are going to be bouncing up and down on that wooden seat. So you've got to get a seat cushion. There's Velcro on the, on the back and bottom of it. It just attaches really easily in. Further bike sends with a little extra Velcro to put onto the further bike. So you just put it in. Next up, the floor mat. This right here is going to protect the floor of the further bike. It's awesome because it catches, you know, grind, dust, wetness, right? And makes it not slippery inside the further bike. And then all you have to do is pull out the mat, shake it out, and put it in again. Next up, it's kind of your all-in-one rain cover, sunshade, wind protector. We pretty much keep this on all the time. Then the last thing that we did, we added on these headlights up front. So let's swing around up here. These headlights are located beneath. They're actually connected to the control panels, so they're easy to turn on while you're riding. The only downside, they don't really function like car headlights. So they're really bright for other cars to see you, but it's not like these lights are lighting up the whole road in front of you. So they're good. They're not great. In fact, I think uh, I may end up adding some lights up for, you know, up a little bit higher. But overall, super happy with the accessories that we added on with our further bike. So we've had this bike for about six months now and getting in and out of it can be a little bit tricky depending on how old your kid is. I've got a two and a half year old boy and he uses the built-in uh, steps and he kind of straddles over, wobbles for a little bit and then kind of tips into the to, to the main box of the Furla bike. But my one-year-old girl, she's an infant, and we actually have to put her in a car seat and put it inside. So what we did, we removed one of the bench seats. The seats are removable, and it completely freed up a good portion of the bike. The downside is, so then imagine like I put my daughter here, and I'm having, to, and this is what I did for like six months room putting it in, I'm resting it in, and it's, honestly, it was a pain every single time. I didn't love it. She liked riding in there, but then getting out, the same thing, where I'm just like, oh, tipping her back, lifting her out. Not ideal, but it's what we've been doing for six months. I did just see that they released on like a, the newest edition or newest version of the further bike. They call it like the Royce edition. Apparently you can now get one with a door that swings open right here. So imagine just opening that up and just stepping right inside. That would have been a dream. I would have loved to have had that. That would have saved me a lot of frustration and annoyance. My kid would have loved it. I would have loved it. Much easier, so highly recommend. Upgrade to the one with the door and your life will be better for it. So I believe it's called the Royce Edition uh, Further Bike. So definitely get that. So earlier I told you how annoying it is to use your own car seat and pulling it in and out of the further bike. 
And lo and behold, Furla Bikes has now introduced their own toddler infant seat attachment and it is amazing. It is a lifesaver for me. I now never have to use my own car seat again with my daughter. But then the infant seat is attached really nice and solidly. Makes life a dream for taking around your little one. I love it and my kid loves it. Now they can you know, face forward, wave to the cars as they go by. So definitely, definitely get this for your child and he or she will love it. So with everything I have told you about the Furla bike, there are a few things I wish they would add. Maybe perhaps additional accessories that could be improved upon that I've come to figure out over the past six months that I've owned this bike. First off is some type of a cushion bar because my kid was always hitting his head right here. So I just simply went to a local hardware store, bought some of this foam that you wrap around pipes and it has made it much more comfortable for my kids so he doesn't bang his head against the bar. Additionally, the bar seems to make some noise when I'm riding and so I realized it was the metal on metal that and so I I tend to wrap this bar inside the further bike with tape to diffuse the noise to minimize the sound I was very concerned about locking the bike I didn't want it stolen I was afraid it was a big purchase for me and I knew no one was just gonna pick the bike up and run away with it it's quite heavy so I ended up purchasing it's just a small disc brake lock and I attach it here, right here to the disc brake. And uh, boom. if anybody were to move the bike, and this alarm would go off. So I'm very happy with that. I think further bikes could add that on as an accessory. Underneath is just open. There's no storage area. So I actually built my own little crate. It would be nice if further bikes could just come out with like a little storage box that you could put underneath. And so I just slide it right under the seat. It adds a little bit of extra storage that I'm happy with. Um, oh, these black seat covers get really, really hot in the sun, like kind of burning hot. So we actually got, it's like, it's a diaper changing cover. And uh, just having that extra bit of cloth just makes the seat way more comfortable for your kid. So it would be nice if further bikes would include cloth seat cover. And then finally, I like to cruise around with either water, music, my phone, but there's no cup holder up here. I want something that I can put my phone in, put my speaker, or put my water bottle, but I have no cup holder here. And right now I'm missing uh, the rear storage rack. I think they're coming out with that. Maybe they have for the newest edition, but definitely I want like a rear cargo rack cup holder, and that would just make life a little bit easier. So there are the things that I'm looking forward to maybe further bikes coming out with that'll help improve an already awesome bike.